Andrew, if these furloughs go through, that means there will be 10% fewer teachers in the district. It will also eliminate several classes and the special education department will take a big hit. The intention is clear on the school board's agenda. The Penn Hill School District plans to furlough 43 teachers by the end of this school year, 23 of them in special education. I'm not very happy. Bob Hoffman is the president of the Penn Hills Education yeah, Association. The district won't comment on this decision, but Hoffman says the impact is too large not to. It's certainly going to affect the educational climate in the district. Um, their students are not going to have the same quality of education that they've had the past so many years um, within Penn Hills. Because Hoffman says along with the teacher's departure will come the elimination of several classes. There's arts, there's technology, there's social studies, his, uh, history portion of that, business, uh, professional experience programs. Cutting these classes, Hoffman says, is how the district is trying to get away with furloughing teachers that they are not allowed to. This line in their contract says no teacher can be furloughed for the duration of the contract, which expires in 2018. But in another section, it allows teaching positions to be eliminated for approved programming changes, something Hoffman says the union will fight during tonight's meeting and vote on these changes. Yeah, we'll have to see what the um, community says tonight. That discussion and vote is scheduled for 730 at Linton Middle School. That is this evening, and the board is expected to allow those furloughs. Reporting live in Penn Hills, Marcy Cipriani, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Marcy, thanks.